Hello out there Keto family. It is time for another meal prep and it's going to be basic and simple because it's going to be based on the groceries that I bought last week in that $50 grocery haul. Check that out if you uh, want to know how you can get a week's worth of groceries for under $50, for $50 or less. So, without further ado, I'm going to show you what our menu is. I'm not going to show you the whole meal prep because you guys have seen me make cheeseburger casserole. You guys have seen me make taco salad and all that fun stuff. So, I'm just going to highlight a few things and there you go. So, stay tuned and I will show you what our menu is for the week. Okay, guys, for tonight, which we're getting a very late start on dinner tonight, it's going to be cheeseburger casserole because it is quick and easy. Pork chops with green beans made with Keto Ginger's recipe. I will link that below. Taco salad for Tuesday. Chicken thighs for Wednesday. We're going to have an egg loaf for Thursday, which is the day I will be fasting. And then chicken nuggets on Friday, which is the day I will break my fast. So I'm looking forward to that. So stay tuned and I'll show you how we prep. To start with, I am going to chop up my pork rinds, which is what's going to coat my um, pork chops and my chicken. So I'll put music over this. Processor. Okay, guys, the cheeseburger casserole for dinner tonight is going to go. Is get almost ready to go into the pot, into the casserole dish to be cooked in the oven. The oven is preheated, and then the taco salad meat is almost ready. It's getting there with some spatulator. Get my spatulator. So I'm going to cook these up and we're going to eat and then I'm probably going to finish up my meal prep later tonight. Okay? Okay guys, the cheeseburger casserole is in the oven. I'm going to go ahead and pre-cook the pork chops for tomorrow night's dinner. And I have the taco mix available for Tuesday night's dinner. So, sorry about my stove guys. I went wild cooking the tacos. So... Yeah, there you go. I'm going to cook those up, and then we're going to probably finish up later tonight. Cheeseburger casserole is done. Check that out. And the last of the chaffles to go with it are in. They're almost done. Got about another minute to go on that, and then we'll be eating dinner. While I'm listening to Dr. Berry in the background, I'm going to start on my chicken nuggets. Which I'm going to go ahead and cook and then freeze them. So all I have to do is heat them up. I don't have the onions or the green peppers to put in here as the recipe calls for, but I'm going to use some onion powder and other fun stuff to spice it up. Okay guys, I am wore out tonight, so this is going to be the end of the meal prep here. I've got to still work out a while to cook, but the chicken's going to go in the oven. This is what's left over from our cheeseburger casserole. Sean's already planning on having that for lunch tomorrow. We've got the pork chops that are ready to go in for tomorrow night's dinner. The taco seasoning mix. I've got chicken nuggets. These are the ones that are done. These are the ones that are cooking. Still have a little bit left to go to cook. And the chicken thighs are pre-cooking in to get the size browned on each side and then they are going to be going into the oven very shortly and cooking and that is my meal prep okay guys that's my meal prep tonight it's very basic and simple and you don't have to be fancy on keto it's kind of fun to try different recipes and I will continue to do that but for this week I wanted to keep it simple and basic because I plan on doing a lot of Instacart shopping this week so I wanted to just be able to just pull things out and throw them in. Um, I still have to prep, chop up the lettuce for the, sa the taco salad and all that fun stuff and that is my cue to go flip the chicken nuggets over. So you guys have a wonderful night and I will see you in the next video. Toodles!